Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Emily Lucy Ratch. I hope you are doing well. Today's video is a sponsored one, which I'm super excited to bring to you guys. It is from Boohoo. We are going full festive, whether that's party outfits or whether that is Christmas markets, everyday comfortable festive wear, then we are going to cover it all today. So I've got lots behind me that I'm about to share with you. I've hung it all up so it's a real mixture of sparkles, feathers and neutrals, which I love for this time of year. Starting with this little number. Look at this guys. It is so festive, cute. We're talking Christmas party, girls dinner or New Year's Eve. I love these Basques that I've seen quite often recently from quite a lot of different brands, but this color is so beautiful. I can't wait to try that on. I didn't know exactly what to put this with because I thought it looks quite short, which it definitely is. It's coming to around here. So I wanted something that's like a little bit high a waisted just to be a bit more flattering in this area. So I chose two skirts to pair it up with. The first one is this long velvet one with a split, which is, has this like knot detail at the top here. And then secondly is this pleated skirt. So both of these I am gonna try with this top now to see if this works together as a look or we could be really wrong on this one and it just does not work. We might have to put this with leather trousers or something like that. So let me get these on to try on for you now. The Basque I have gone for a size 14. I do find that Boohoo sizing can be quite small so I've sized up quite a lot on most things. However, the skirt I've actually got in a 12 because I knew it had a stretchy waistband and I wanted it to fit nicely and not look too big. Um, and then I've got the velvet skirt in a 14 which I feel like looks slightly big so let me try these on and let's talk about sizing okay so the top was an absolute disaster on my bus so i would 1000 percent recommend sizing up because it's just not even being able to fasten at the back so i'm just holding up for dramatic effect right now but the skirt is super cute i love the skirt and i actually don't mind this together i thought it might be a disaster but it actually is really cute and quite simple but that's right at the same time. I'm gonna try the other skirt on with this look right now. It's really hard for me to be able to show what this looks like because it just really does not fit my bust. I don't know who I was thinking I was gonna get my boobies in to a 14 in this. Definitely need to size it up. But yeah, I just think it's like really unusual and cute. I actually quite like the turquoise with the black together. So let me just try on the other skirt quickly now. Now I've swapped skirts. I actually think the length of the skirt goes much better with the top. So I really do actually quite like this look. I just wish the top fitted me. So I'll show you how it looks full length here as well but the skirt is actually lovely i feel like this would look really nice just a simple black bodysuit as well or even like another bass top or whatever you want to put with it but obviously if you want to go for something really glam then this look together does actually work really well it's just going to be difficult to get the sizing right for somebody who's got a bigger bust like me um but the skirt in the 14 it fits actually perfectly so i don't actually mind this look as much as i was a bit hesitant i think it's actually quite nice if you can get the top to fit in the right way the dress that i'm actually wearing now is also boohoo i just love a long sleeved dress for this time of year with some cute boots this one is in 14 and it has this nice ruching detail here i don't have any shapewear or tights on with it so i would probably put some shapewear on with it because it is quite tight um, but it just has this really nice ruching detail here which i love and i think the color is so nice and then i've also tinned it up with this little detailed earring i'm seeing loads of these at the moment as well where it's more of like a cuff around the ear and then it actually is pierced at the bottom bit here so it makes it look like you've got more ear piercings than you actually have i just think it makes any outfit just look like a little bit more special and i'm going to obviously try it on with quite a few of the christmas looks now but i just wanted to mention it in case you were looking at it and thought where is that from everything i'm wearing today is actually from boohoo and i'll link everything down below the next look i have got to share with you guys is this real sparkly number so i've got the basque in a 14 this looks very small so i'm not holding off for this one with my 30 six double d boobs but we'll see and then this skirt wow it is a floor length maxi skirt with this really high side split so i won't be wearing shapewear underneath it because you'll be able to see the shapewear unless i go for like a pants style shapewear so i will try that on as a look together now i got the skirt i think in a 14 too yeah 14 so both are in a size 14 so the top actually fits really well i'm surprised because i thought from the last one this one would also be too small but this actually fits me perfectly you can adjust the straps you can have it up like this or you can have it off like i've just done and have this as more as a basque area um it is a little bit short i would i do wish it was longer so it gave me a bit more of a flattering shape here 
media. Um, but the skirt is absolutely huge for a 14. I thought this was a 16 to be honest when I put it on because there is literally so much room, which you never really find with sequin skirts. Usually it's the opposite. But if I had got this in a 12, though, I would have thought there would be no way it would fit me. But I think I actually do need the 12 in it. I love how high the split is. It is giving glam vibes, old Hollywood style. Um, the only thing is, like I said, I feel like it's too short in the body, this basque to wear with this skirt. Because I feel like it's actually hitting me in a really unflattering way here. So it'd have to be either a longer basque and the skirt in a smaller size so it looks more like this or actually because the skirt is so forgiving and like not tight around the waist it actually would look really good with a shorter crop top because i feel like it actually would be really flattering on your stomach area the only thing is i feel like it's going to keep moving down which then will be belly button on show which i am just not doing that ever again <laughs> So yeah, I think this one's actually a bit of a miss, which is sad because there's so much potential there. Um, I wonder if there actually is like a matching top to this, which I will link down below if there is. But I love the basque. I feel like, like I said, I wish it was just slightly longer. And um, the only way to do that is to adjust the straps. But I feel like then you are just losing the shape. I feel like that does actually look better without the straps. So it's just kind of vibe, which I love. I think the skirt... It's really hard to tell what it would look like without getting the smaller size because you need to see where it would fit to the body and where it would come in. Whereas at the moment, it's looking a little bit shapeless because it's just so big on me. So definitely size down if you love this skirt as much as I do. So now we are into the comfies, which I love. I love a good comfy outfit this time of year. And I feel like Boohoo do it so well. So I've gone for this oversized set in this like creamy color. You will see on Instagram and TikTok, I do tend to wear day to day a lot of these kind of light shades sweatshirts um, and then I've got them as a set so it obviously comes with the joggers personally I don't really wear them as a set that often I would wear this with a bodysuit um, and like a cardigan or a different style of jacket something like a maybe a cream coat um, and then the same with the sweatshirt I would wear that with just black leggings socks Uggs and everyday so I'd actually split the set but for the purpose of this video I'm actually going to try it on together um, and then if you head over to my shorts or to Instagram or TikTok I probably will use these pieces in two separate ways and style them up separately so you can get two different ideas. The set I actually got in a size large and as I mentioned previously everything is linked down below in the description if you wanted to shop any of these bits. And I'm also going to try it on with this gilet. I just love the idea of a brown gilet at the moment. I feel like it looks so cute this outfit together with some Uggs or my Balenciaga trainers. I'm going to try that as a look together for you now. So this is how the set looks. As you can see this is the full look together. I did mention I feel like it is very oversized and not the most flattering to put them both together. So I probably wouldn't wear them like this as a set. I would have it as two separate pieces that I wear in different ways. So I would team this jumper up with some brown leggings maybe and my Ugg boots and then I would do these joggers with like a bodysuit like this like shapewear or a bodysuit um, and not the gilet so that it just breaks up and makes it into two separate pieces obviously it's complete personal preference you might like this like oversized look um, but for me, I just feel like it, it's not the most flattering on my short body shape and size. Um, but I just love these colours together. Like, I just love how this looks so cosy and comfortable. Like, I can just imagine, like, having a hangover day where you just, like, need to go to the shop and you want to feel comfortable. Or you want to have, like, a Christmas shopping day where you feel comfortable. Or even just a day where, you know, you need to go and do your Marks and Spencer's food shop. Get that picky tea bits. Get that camembert then you could literally just throw this on and feel comfortable in it. It's super, super comfortable. Um, but like I said, for me, I will be changing them and wearing them as separates just so it balances my body shape out a little bit better. Then again, more of a comfortable everyday look for this time of year, whether that's just going to markets or Christmas shopping, you wanna wear comfortable shoes. Like I just love to go Christmas shopping in my ultra mini Uggs. So this had that in mind. I love at the moment these style of half zip up tops. This one did actually come as a set, so it came with shorts, which are gonna be great for summer because as we transition into spring, we'll be able to get this out and wear it with the shorts as a matching set and trainers and have your legs out. But while we are in the colder months, you can definitely double this up with some leggings, like these ones I've picked up, again, from Boohoo. These ones are in a size 14, and the top set is in a size 
16. I wanted that really oversized look with white socks and Ugg boots and then a really cool coat over the top. So I've gone for this one, which is this really oversized white coat. And I feel like all these things together will look really cute with my cream cross YSL college bag, my Ugg boots, and I'm thinking like a little cute hat as well. So that I'll feel nice and festive and cute at Christmas markets this year. But I've gone for lighter shades rather than typical dark colors that I usually wear. So I wanted to try this look all together. I got the coat in a size 14 the leggings in a 14 and the set with the zip up in a 16 so I'll try all these bits on for you now now I've got this top on instead of putting it with the green leggings because they were a little bit too big which I'll show you in a second I have actually put it with these Gymshark leggings which looks really nice and I've also got here a full look of how I've styled it in different ways but I just love how oversized it is it's so nice for like Christmas markets and just having a really nice oversized top in your wardrobe to put with different things like I said it'll be really good for spring to wear shorts and stuff too but i just feel like it's so comfortable i love it i actually prefer this to the one i had previously so this is the leggings i think i prefer to wear this with the other leggings from gymshark this is the leggings i just feel like they fit nice but they're just a little bit sheer so you'd have to wear them like this and they're a little bit loose. I teamed them up with the Gymshark ones to show you like a small similar colour scheme which worked really well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I haven't done a Boohoo haul in so long so I really enjoyed putting those looks together. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And if you have made it to the end of this video, I just want to say thank you so much for all your support on YouTube and helping me get to 100k, which I now have received my award for. So thank you so, so much. It means the world to me to have your support on here, guys. And I feel like this is such a milestone that I have got to all thanks to you guys keeping me going so like I said if you have made it to the end of this video thank you so much for your support this one's for you and I am so thankful for everything you do for me by watching my videos commenting liking subscribing so thank you so much and I'll catch you guys in the next one bye